In this short tutorial, I just want to show you some thoughts on how you can clean up some zip code data to make it standardized and more easy to use. So, here we have some random numbers, and we want this formatted to be in a zip code, like kind of what we see in cell C7. And as you can see, the formatting is all over the place. So, first, to clean up the numbers, we want to highlight the data, then press Control H to bring up Find and Select now. Uh, we want to not. We don't want to find. We want to replace, and you want to replace a dash so that you see right here in some of these numbers with nothing. And the thought here is to, to just get everything in a standardized format. So you, and you just want to click replace all, and as you can see, four replacements were made, and now our data is all standardized. And in this specific case, when it's zip codes, Excel actually has some special formatting options for zip codes and phone numbers. So to use this, we can go to home number more number formats and we can go over here to special and as you can see excel has some standard special formatting for zip codes of code plus four phone number and social security numbers but in this instance we want to just have it as a zip code format and then click ok and as you can see we also as you can see now we have a zip code format um, another approach of working with different data is you can consider using like a concat function and and you can use the concat function in left, kind of in right, and use a combination of that. I can explain that in another video. Um, but you can kind of you can kind of break the data apart and bring it together with the concat function to make it what you want it to be as a thought. But you know, not the context of this video. That that's it. I hope this will be helpful. If you did, like, subscribe, comment. Thank you for watching. You have a great day.